What's up ladies and gentlemen? I thought I'd make a quick video. I'm gonna try to keep it short, you know, hopefully under 10, 15 minutes. But today's video is Christmas shopping, okay, at your local Home Depot. And what I mean by Christmas shopping, no, you're not here to buy toys for the kids. We all know that. I mean, hey, there's nothing wrong with buying your husband a, you know, a tool or two. Or maybe your favorite handyman, you can send him a gift card. Okay? But what I'm going to show you here is the Christmas decorations, as you can see out here. Wreaths, beautiful ones, decorated. And we're going to go into the Christmas tree section. We're going to check out the ornaments and all kinds of stuff, okay? All the Christmas decorations. We're going to scan by a few of the prices. And, yeah, inside we have a big space here. Um, I'm not sure the square footage. I want to say it's... Uh, I'll find out. I think it's maybe 50 or 60,000 square feet of uh, garden center. It might even be more. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm driving around in circles here. I'm here early. That's why you don't see too many people. And it's a Friday morning. A lot of people are at work. Um, we're going to go in, let me park, and we're going to go through a few of these prices. Okay, we come up to some beautiful Alberta spruces. Okay. These things are pretty nice. They're big. They got to be close to five feet tall. $129. And what's nice about these guys are, it's not only for Christmas, but you can put these in big wine barrels by the pool if you have a pool or you can plant these in the yard okay so it's not just for Christmas and look they come with solar powered lighting that's pretty cool not a bad price well, we got a Weber here this could be a nice little Weber for high ridge handyman we're gonna have to inquire see if it's on sale not bad over here wow 36 I'm going to say 36 inch wreath $49 tell you what they're thick too they're not flimsy they got a lot of ornaments on there and a nice big bow you go to a local nursery you'll pay 75 probably $100 for that no, no problem so that's half price $49 you need a wreath for the door you have a big enough door get down to the Home Depot it's $49 I mean, you'd be crazy to spend more than that. Save the money for the kids. You're going to need it. What do we have here? This is a 30 inch. And this is more my style here for my front door. I got a smaller house. I'll tell you what. They're pretty solid and they're green. There's no dryness. These are fresh. Price on these. I'll have to inquire inside. We got prices here for a 36. All right, maybe we'll find it somewhere else. Then you have your plain wreaths. You can get a 48-inch wreath. That's four feet. Okay, 69 bucks. That's a big wreath. So if you have a little office building, maybe you need two of them. You're only talking 140 dollars. Go to a nurse, go somewhere else, you'll pay $150, $160 just for the wreath. All right, here we go, 26 inch wreath. This is your most common size, 29 bucks. Tell you what, these are nice. Let me pull it out just to show you what it looks like by itself. I'll hang it up here. It's a nice one. Let's put it back. Another thing, a lot of people, they take stuff out, they don't put it back. No respect. Okay. So you got your 26-inch for 29 bucks. A lot of 26ers. This is nice here. I like when they're thick. Looks nice. I might grab that one on the way out. Oh, and look, we got a 22-inch wreath for $24. Wow. You really can't tell the difference. 22 to 26. I mean, yeah, it's another 
five, six dollars, but you can't tell the difference. I'd go up to 22 inch. What do we have here? It's nice to have this stuff up. I'll get people out here, maybe. Get a pot. Get a pot on top. So hold it up. I got these in the parking lot. Somebody's gonna hit it. I got it right in the driveway part. Those are nice. Forty-nine dollars. Tell you what, mixed greens. Look at that by the front door for fifty bucks. It's even nice. It's got the berries in it. Beautiful. Forty-nine dollars. You can't go wrong. Look at this one. With the pine cones. That is a beautiful one. It's got a little bit of uh, a little bit of everything in there. Wow, this one's nice. 49 bucks, you can't go wrong. Look at that. Probably gonna grab that too on the way out. Here you go, 22 inch wreath, $19. Where are you gonna find this for 20 bucks? I mean, look at this thing. Let me hang it up over here and I'll back up a little bit. 20 bucks, cuz. And for all you people out there, you could reuse these next year if you wanted to. You get yourself a plain wreath for probably eight, nine dollars next year, ten dollars, and you reuse them. A little secret high ridge handyman's gonna pass on to you. Then you got people for 19 bucks, they'll just buy it when it's done, toss it in the garbage. And here you go, look, twelve dollars. Get yourself a couple of plain ones, put them out by the stone wall. For twelve dollars, you get five or six of them make the house look nice All right, let's head in this way let's check out these trees more wreaths over here these wreaths should be out front they're hiding in the corner for 19 bucks get them out front. All right, I don't see anyone out here It'd be nice to maybe have someone on staff out here asking me if I'm interested in anything and trying to push some of this product but maybe it's too early for them I don't know we got some bushes out here These aren't bad. Nice little trees here. 44 bucks for a little Alberta. It's got a nice little, nice little pot there with handles. Here you go with the uh, solar powered lights. That's a nice little add-on. You don't have to light them up. You don't have to plug them in or anything. What's back here? We got some winter gems over here. Not bad, 29 bucks. Again. You can plant these in the yard, okay? Good prices. These are the little trees. Grab a couple of these if you're going to a cemetery. $20, come on. You can't go wrong. Having a Christmas party at the house. Six or seven of those. Put them all over the property if you want. I don't know, up in, uh, around the staircases or steps. We got some wreaths out there by themselves. Some roping. Let's take a walk over to the roping. It's, uh, you know what? I think it's no, the wreaths. I'm sorry. Oh, wow. I've, this one's seen better days. What are we doing? When you have stuff like this, look, you got to throw this out. It shouldn't be out here. And people are going to look and say, well, that's what the wreaths are going to turn into. I mean, look, look at this. This looks like the crown for, that was used in, the, in uh, that movie, the Christ movie. I mean, what are we doing here? All right, enough with that. Let's go over here. Oh, look at these. We got the blankets, $34, cemetery blankets. These are nice. That's a great deal. That's a great deal. We got a little tree that's down. Let's put them back up. A little Charlie Brown tree. Get them back up, make them look nice. What do we got here? We got some door swags, cuz if you don't know what that is, Hanging on the door goes like this. Boom, over the door. 14 bucks, 15 bucks, not bad. Small little, small little planters. How much are these? These aren't bad. Nice little gift if you're going to someone's house. Let's see if I can find a price on these. No price. I wouldn't imagine them being no more than 10, 12 dollars. All right, we got people coming in now. Flip flops, it's freezing out here. All right, 
Look at these little guys. 1998 Holiday Decor. Okay. Check this out. It's a nice little wooden made basket with a handle. Put this right in the middle of your living room table. Your, I'm sorry, your dining room table. <laughs> the living room table. Right in the middle, maybe. A little decorations. Oh, we got the little trees here. Tabletops. $24. If you live in an apartment building and you're not allowed to have, you know, a full-size real tree, get down here. It comes with a stand. $24. Come on. It'll make the apartment smell nice. They should be spaced out a little bit. Look, just looks like a big clump. But I guess that's, you know, you got to do what you got to do with the space. More holiday decor. 8-inch holiday whiskey barrel. $24. Nice little barrels. They got white. They got brown. And then over here, we got more whiskey barrels. This is a bigger one for $39 pretty decorative listen you put a couple by the front door you can't beat the prices oh, look all the little guys fell over you know what I'm gonna leave them you know the day when I have uh, when I have time to come over here and do the work I'll do it but I gotta leave those for now but yeah these are all just little guys on the corner oh here we go $14.98 for the little things here so if you're going to a family party for 15 bucks you look like a champ it's cheap Try stopping into a nursery. You pay $30, $40 for that little thing. What do we got here? Oh, these are nice. My daughter would like something like this, you know? Put this in her little bedroom. Price is on the other side. Doesn't make sense, but it's right there. $9.98. I put it over on this side, but I don't want the guys to think I'm screwing around with their stuff. And we got some uh, mixed green birch planters for $19.98. Pretty nice. Get one out in the open so you can see what it looks like. Pretty nice. Let's head in and take a look at the trees. Now here we go. We got a nice wreath. You can't beat it. 48 inch, $99. And it's decorated. $99. Here's all the roping. What do we got? 25 feet of pine roping for 17 bucks. That's cheap. 25 feet. So you get yourself a roll. Not bad. All the trees wrapped. They got some Frasers. Okay, here you go. Seven to eight footers, 59 bucks. Okay. It's a Frasier fir. The needles last the longest. They stay on the tree the longest. That's what you want to get. And they hold heavy ornaments. Seven to eight footers, 59. We got the mixed roping. Okay. White pine and boxwood, $24 for 25 feet. Look at this. Not bad. What do we got over here? A six to seven foot Fraser for $49. All right. We got some empty space here. I'm sure they can clean this up, sweep it up, and put some stock out here. Maybe bring some of those trees that were hidden in that corner. Bring them in here. You know, that's just me though. Alright, so we got, what do we got over here? We got some little, for $14.99. Alright. We got the little dwarf Albertas for 15 bucks. Not bad. What do we got here? We got the uh, Holly. Hollies are nice, okay. Holly's $29.98. And that is uh, maybe a three gallon, okay? Not bad, good price. And we got some other stuff down here. 
some shrubs and stuff like that. More trees. Let's see what these prices are. Balsam fir, 29 bucks. Five to six footers. Six to seven, 39. It's cheap. Tell you what, the trees look nice. Not bad. I'm not pulling any out. I don't want to get sap and shit on my hands. That's a nice one right there. Got to shake it out a little bit. Again, trees on the floor. I don't know. Balsam for six to eight, fifty-nine dollars. Tell you what, either they're buying, they're, they sold a lot because there's not too many trees here in these bins. Look at all this room. You know, they must have sold a lot. We got some seven to eight foot balsams. Balsams are good trees because they smell nice. They smell a lot stronger than the Frasers, but the Fraser firs are the, the best quality trees they sell by far. You thank yourself when you're out there and you got to clean up at the end. All right. Got some big ones here. I don't know where the prices are on these big guys. Oh, eight to nine footers. Eight to nine foot Frasers, $79. $80 for a nine foot Frasier. That's crazy. That's a good price. Now let's go over here. We got, oh look, they got a, they got a tree set up. And we got some kissing balls, guys. Kissing balls. All right, $34.98 for the kissing balls. All right, it's getting a little cold. What I'm going to do is I'm going to head in, into the store. Let's we'll see if they got some decorations going on inside. What do we have here? What is this? And just another like a swag for a table or something. Or maybe, a, you know what this is for? You put this across a uh, mantle. A mantle piece. They're nice. 34 bucks. Yeah, look. Mantle, cuz. I knew what I was talking about. All right, then we got these little baby things. Look at this. Little baby wreath. Either you put on a table, maybe a candle in the middle, or you hang a couple, you know, hang a couple around the house. How much are these guys? There you go. It's a candle ring. I was right. Put a candle in the middle, cuz. I should work here. $14.98 candle ring. And there are those tins again. Tell you they're great gifts if you're going to a, a holiday party pick them up they last what do we got out here a little setup how you doing sir how are you i'm good thank you all right let's oh here he is what's going on there pal oh, oh, oh. all right cool man we'll talk to you soon all right, let's head inside and see what they have oh here we go the point set is and it's nice and warm Six inch, four ninety eight. Come on, dude. And it's wrapped nice in plastic for under under five dollars. Remember, if you have dogs, very poisonous. So if you have dogs that are uh, getting into things like Sunny, you don't want to have these in the house. So be careful. What do we have here? We have a nice tropical foliage, fancy, nineteen ninety eight. They're pretty nice. You have an apartment, you have something year round, pick up one of these bad boys. Put a few of those uh, LED lights on there, the, the light, light, Pete, the light uh, strands. There's your tree. Boom. What do we got? Oh, here we go. 19 bucks. These things are huge. Look at this for $19. Let me put it on the ground. That's a big one. This thing is about two and a, two and a half feet tall. All right, it's pretty heavy too. Twenty bucks. People are buying these for twenty, and they're selling them to their customers probably more. It's another thing you got to look out for. Cause you can come down here and buy them for twenty. Here you go, six inch again, four ninety eight. Another good housewarming gift for Christmas or if someone's having a party. You grab three or four of these, bring them to someone's house. Boom, you're done. Eight inch. $14.98.
pink. Nice. Really, it really looks good. They got some nice points out of here. These 498s are the best. I'm gonna grab three of these, put them around the house on the way out. All right, let's head inside and check out the lights and this, the uh, the trees and stuff. See what they have. Ah, oh, here we go. Look at this. I know the video is getting kind of long, but I'm just trying to give you guys as much information as possible. Is that my boy Woody up there? That is. My son would go crazy. He loves Toy Story. One twenty-nine for a Woody and the dog. Wait a minute. I, I think I have to get it. It's that Slinky dog. Let me see if they have it. Sometimes you have to buy the actual item that's up on the shelf. Yeah, let me see, where is it? I got some minions up there, Scrooge. Look at that big Santa Claus for 69 bucks. That thing's huge, nine feet tall. It'd be as tall as my house. <laughs> Look at the dragon spitting out fire cuz wow, look at the dog the Burmese mountain dog for 99 bucks king of the jungle uh, nice unicorn up there if you're gonna buy Christmas lights for the house I recommend the LED I know they're more expensive but back up because they're starting to work in here so I don't want to get in their way we got some trees here or uh, artificial believe it or not I have an artificial tree I've had it for a long time I bought mine believe at Target okay yeah Target it's a six foot six and a half foot tall and it's skinny and it's easy and it's pre-lit and that's what I like just easy for me wow I got a nice selection here Look up here. Now you can buy wreaths, fake ones. $59, okay, 32 inch, and you'll have it every year, and has a built-in pack here. They're doing all these packs, they're putting in these things. I don't know how to turn it on. You probably have to, uh, Yeah, you have to put batteries in it and then you just hit the button. But that's a good that's a good option. You buy it once, you have it forever. As long as you uh, put it somewhere safe and it doesn't get crushed. Oh, look at this. Big poinsettia is 20 bucks. It's definitely the place to come if you're looking for poinsettias. And you have all these nice wreaths over here. Let's take a quick look. I think we're gonna end the video soon. Yeah, we're 20 minutes in. I apologize. But I appreciate everybody taking the time. 79 bucks. It's a 36 inch. 59. Not bad. It's got the fake snow look. 59. Another one, 59. I mean, listen. If you have a, if you're that person who has a few homes around and you're not really there all the time to maintain the real stuff, buy one of these. Buy a, a handful. And then you have your people take it off, they store it away. I mean, you can't go wrong. And they're nice. They don't look like the cheap ones, you know? Nice. All right, well, listen, if you're looking for uh, Christmas stuff, get your butt over to the Home Depot, local Home Depot. They're pretty much all the same. My store, I have to say, is the best. You know, I have to say because I live here. But anyway, look at that point set of multicolored, beautiful. That's only six, uh, 17 bucks. That's a nice gift right there. But yeah, definitely head over to your local Home Depot and pick up that stuff for Christmas. Get out there while supplies last. I mean, a lot of this stuff, it goes quick. We got the mini incandescent lights, 300 pack, 898. It's not LED, I don't believe. 
here you go. The, the LED tree, look at that. That's pretty cool. All right, well, again, I want to thank you for watching. If you haven't already subscribed, hit, the, hit that subscribe button, cuz. And if you like the Home Depot, hit the like, too. And uh, let me know in the comments if you've bought, if you've gotten anything this year from Home Depot, what it was and how much it was, if it was a good deal or not. In the meantime, I'm going to have to take a look to see if I can get one of them woodies for my son. I will catch you on the next one. Wait a minute. You know, where is he? Sonny? Sonny. Yo, Sonny. Hey, yo, Sonny! There you go. You thought I was going to forget you, my boy, Sonny. What do you say, Sonny? What are you eating? Oh, come on, man. All right, we'll catch you on the next one, right, Sonny?